So I got five bags of compost, so hopefully that combined with what I have at home will cover us for everything we need. We make compost, but we don't make enough. We can't seem to produce enough for our garden, especially since we've expanded it a little bit. Uh, I have, uh, my main garden is about 250 square feet. I know that's not big, but I'm here in the city, so I do what I can. I don't have a huge lot. And then we have two beds in the front of the house. And then I also have about 20 buckets uh, that I have to put soil back in and mix with some compost. So hopefully I'll have enough. So last year I piled up all of my dirt from my buckets here in the pile in the garden and then so I've just cleaned my buckets out and gave them a little sanitize. And now I'm just filling them up about three quarters getting ready uh, to add some compost and then some more dirt and get just get them ready for uh, planting. And that's it, I'm just leaving these buckets like this, three quarters full, because I'm not even sure what's going in them yet. Last year I had peppers, broccoli, and tomatoes in there. So uh, definitely, well, most likely gonna do the peppers in there this year. Um, I'm considering doing the broccoli again, and then the tomatoes I'm actually doing in the back corner over there, um, but I probably end up doing some in the buckets as well. So this is our compost down here and that's uh, this stuff's ready to go. I'll be using that this year. So I don't think that's enough for the whole garden where I want to use it. And then over here, uh, this is the stuff we're working on. This is not ready to go, but I do have to adjust it. I piled some wood over here and it folded everything over. So I'll have to readjust that. It's funny how grass spreads so easily. Well, here's why. This is the piece of grass that was sticking out and same with this little piece here. And look at the root that was underneath that long grassroots. I brought my cool weather plants, my kale and my lettuce outside just to kind of start harding them off. I'd like to have them out uh, in the garden next week. Right now it's about 10 degrees Celsius, which is about 50 Fahrenheit. Uh, it's a little cool. Uh, not for these actually, these would probably be okay, but we're gonna go down to one uh, in a couple of days. So I'm just gonna wait until next week. I'm gonna harden these off and get them ready for outside. Can't wait. Not sure about some of this lettuce though. This one seems to be doing really good. And then I've got this one here, not doing so well. I think some of them have been a little too wet. Did you see that drip out of there? Look at that. I didn't even water this one just now. Too wet. So that's it. Just thought you might want to uh, come along and see some of the things I'm doing to get ready for uh, planting. Now I gotta go clean up and go inside and have a nice cup of coffee. So uh, remember the most important thing folks, take care of yourself. Picked some dandelion root. People say it makes really good coffee so I think I might actually try and dry it out and see what happens. Can't hurt, can it? Can it kill me? I hope not.